Hey guys, what's up? Multigame for the win here, and in today's Sea of Thieves video, we have a lot to talk about with the new 1.0.6 update. Rare has just implemented the game as of today. So, there's a lot of new customization items, and I want to get to a lot of them. And it's a little bit of a short video, so, you know, most of it actually focuses on the trading company. Not the trading companies, the vendors what's on the outposts, and a lot of new stuff that everyone's been asking for. So, without further ado, um... Uh, I say we get right into it so we can get this done. Uh, so I'm down. Alright guys, so we are here in front of the Armor Smith or Armory, whatever you want to call it. And I'm next to the Ye Olde Clothes Shoppy. And then we're going to go from there to the Ye Olde uh, Tool Shoppy. And then over to the um, Ship Customization or whatever you want to call it. I can't think of it right now. Uh, but we're going to start off with the new armory. So they've actually added a lot of new stuff in. But one of the things you will notice first if you decide to go get a new weapon is the launch crew Eye of Reach. And it goes as follows. As the good ships, as the good ship Sea of Thieves set sail, a bottle was smashed on her side and said thank you. Okay, thank you. So this is the new Eye of Reach. It is available for about two weeks um, as of today. So you can get it within two weeks from now. Uh, and then it'll be gone forever. And it's only one coin, so it's, it's surprisingly cheap. And if you don't have that, then that's sad. So you also notice, if I'm not mistaken, they've like minimized the stock. You'll notice that as a trend throughout the different vendors. Um, there's not a whole lot of weapons, but we're going to go ahead and go and equip this new Eye of Reach. Um, and I obviously have two. I have the Sovereign one, the Imperial Sovereign one, and the Launch Crew. So... Um, I guess we're going to go ahead and equip this uh, set of blunderbuss and go ahead and take a look. So first thing you notice is there's a bottle there and it does say launch screw in the side which is a nice little touch. And uh, we're going to go ahead and look down the scope so you notice right away also that I think it's a little different than the normal ones. It, it's the, the image you get from through the scope is different. Uh, we're going to go ahead and see how it shoots. I um, mean if you didn't notice the audio is pretty good at this time. I think I figured out what it was. I think I let it get to 10 minutes which is the maximum of record at one time and I think that messed it up. So now we're going to go ahead and take a look at the uh, this one here, the nice one. And you'll notice the image is not discolored, um, which is interesting. So I think I'm definitely going to use the launch crew one. And like I said, it is available for two weeks after launch starting today. And it's only for one gold coin. So if you don't have that, we got to talk. You're not no pirate. So they have a lot of new stuff. And a lot of them is new clothing items. So we're going to go ahead and start here at the clothing shop. You'll notice as well, um, maybe not right away. Uh, but shopkeepers in different regions only stock certain items due to deliveries, you know, just different, uh, which makes sense. So that's why the stock is diminished. And uh, there's there's new clothes. There's a new line of Executive Admiral, Grand Admiral, Rotten Bilge Rat, Castaway Bilge Rat, Crossier Sea Dog. Ruff, Ruffian, I think it's Ruffian Sea Dog, and Imperial Sovereign. So you notice right here, this uh, this one here is the Rotten Build Rat. It's one of the new ones. A Castaway Build Rat, I think, is one of the new ones. Um, and you'll notice, uh, I think that's new. I think I haven't been to the clothing shop in a little while, um, but that's new. And I don't think they've added any new weapons. I mean, any new um, tools. But they've they've changed ship customizations around a little bit. Uh, so we're going over that too. Uh, and as you'll see here with the hats, you'll see there's a new Castaway Bilge Rat one um, and the new uh, Imperial Sovereign one. So along with that, there's multiple new ship cosmetics you can purchase uh, from the Grand Admiral, the Castaway Bilge Rat, Ruffian Sea Dog, and Imperial uh, so Sovereign ship customization sets. And uh, you can visit the weapon shops and find their stocks with Grand Admiral, Castaway Bilge Rat, Ruffian Sea Dog, and Imperial Sovereign weapons. You can get a different new style. So along with all of this, we're just going to go ahead and check out the tool shop anyways. Uh, along with this, the long-awaited skeleton accuracy problem. They have fixed skeletons when shooting from islands with long distances with cannons. And skeleton accuracy has been reduced. Um, so that's good because I kind of find it a little... I found it annoying that they always hit you with that pistol, or with the, uh, yeah, with the pistol. It was just really annoying and not necessary, and, uh, yeah. So, Merchant Voyages, um, it's no longer possible to for force Merchant Voyages to, uh, request delivery in a specific outpost. Um, so that's pretty good. Um, and there's, uh, a bell on the small, on the, the bell on the small ship has been moved to 
the other side of the ladder to avoid accidental ringing when redecorating uh, with the ammo crate and the bell moved. So, um, no more sneaky climbing. There's also um, been new stuff for um, when you join a dead player. Oh, and here's shift customizations. You'll notice these are different as well. The different heads just had different colors on them and just different things. Uh, so, basically... Oh, look at this. Okay, so Hunter of Cursed Skull, Hunter of Cursed Crews, and Hunter of Fort Skull's commendations now track. That's nice. So there's a lot of different cool things. Uh, loot items can no longer be dropped behind the captain's table on a small ship when trying to place them on the table. Ah, so that's nice. Helpful. So there's a lot of new things they've uh, added in, and I'm not going to read them all off because we don't have time for that. Uh, but I will leave a link for this in the description down below if you're at all interested in checking it out. So with that being said, uh, we're just going to check this real quick. I don't think there's anything new here. But uh, I've been Multigam for the win, and I hope to see you guys on the Sea of Thieves. It has been a great launch within the next within the first month of launch. And i got to hand it to Rare. They've been handling with a lot. They've been handling a lot uh, lately, and that's that's they've been handling it pretty well. So I give them my full credits to that. And uh, so I hope to see you guys on the Sea of Thieves. If you guys see me, go ahead and say hello, sync me, whatever you want to do. Um, <laughs> So uh, this is your friendly neighborhood pirate signing.